Hey friends, this is Reverend Jerry, the People's Priest, a.k.a. Father Jerry. And today I am coming to you with your Monday Musings. So a year ago I had this very vivid dream where I was in the midst of a storm, but instead of rain, people were falling out of the sky. And they would go the different directions, north, south, east, west. And in the midst of the dream, I realized all of these folks were medicine people. Now, it's interesting that this is what the dream was, because the dream happened at the beginning of the pandemic, when we were starting to get first cases and states were talking about shutting down and all of that jazz. You all remember, you were all there. Medicine people in traditional Native American spirituality were the individuals, or I should say are the individuals, who hold the sacred teachings that have to do with the four sacred medicines. The four sacred medicines are tobacco, sage, cedar, and sweetgrass. Each one of these four sacred medicines teaches us what it means to live in right relationship with ourselves, with our community, and with the world. I think it's very important that this dream happened at the beginning of the pandemic because what I have learned in discerning and praying about this dream is that we need in our society more people who actively live in ways that are wise, that are intentional, that are holistic, and that inspire us to be people who heal and liberate. What's interesting is when you go to a medicine person, they don't prescribe to you, oh, you need some sage or you need some tobacco. What they do is they tell you stories. They tell you stories about what has gone on in their life, lessons that they've learned, lessons that are ancient lessons that have been passed on from generations to generations through the elders, or they might give you a task to do. And the whole purpose is that in our Western understanding of medicine, we are told that you have to take a pill, you have to take a shot, and all that's important. But that's not the only avenue that we need to go about in living a holistic life. We need to take our vaccines, we need to take our pills, we need to do all of that. That's essential for living a holistic life. But we also have to remember the stories, the rituals that we go through in life because we need to bring our whole self to this world. Medicine people teach us not to segment ourselves but to live holistically. So this week as you go throughout your day or your week or your day and your week, whatever it might be, inspire yourself and those around you to practice healing. Tell stories. Tell the stories of your ancestors. Tell the stories of those you have encountered in the, the life that you live. And in so doing, you are practicing the way of the medicine person. You are bringing salvation, which actually comes from the same word as salve, which is like a healing oil, massaging your body, massaging your soul. So remember, dear friends, life is short. We do not have much time to gladden the hearts of those who journey with us. So be swift to love, make haste to be kind, and dare to be the medicine people that we need in this world. Monday Musings is a weekly reflection series brought to you by Rev. Jerry Maynard, the People's Priest, and produced by CNG Communications. For a small donation of $25 per month, you can be listed as a podcast sponsor. For more information, please visit revjerrymaynard.org and click on the People's Priest podcast under the media tab.